Alright, if you have any tips on how to get that, comment it down below. But yo, what's up McCuties? Welcome back to another video. I'm your host, McHugh. How you doing today? Right now, I'm at my old school, Capital University. Just getting a little training session in. I've been working on my left foot, some freestyle, conditioning, and other random things. I'll say, it is weird not playing on a team. I mean, I played on high school, I played on club, I played college, and now that I don't have a team, it's kind of weird. But I am so obsessed with the game, yo. I will never stop playing. I gotta admit though, there are times now where I kind of struggle with motivation. I mean, playing on a team, you got all sorts of players around you that are pushing you to be your best. And in the real world, when you're no longer playing for a team, it's all on you. Thankfully, somebody that I've been looking up to a lot is Kobe Bryant. Rest in peace. But yo, this dude, talk about fucking passion, commitment, and obsession for the game. I'm gonna roll a little clip right here from an interview I watched. Really let it soak in. Brian Drummond has to put it up with the buzzer. Banks it in! Ha-ha! He banks in the three! I think the greatest fear that we face is ourselves, actually. It's not anything that's external or anything that's superficial. I think the greatest fear you face is yourself because you know, we all have dreams and it's very scary sometimes to accept the dream that you have. And it's scarier still to say, okay, I want that. It's scary because you're afraid that if you put your heart and soul into it and you fail, then how are you gonna feel about yourself, right? So being fearless means putting yourself out there and going for it, no matter what, go for it. Not for anybody else, but for yourself. You already know, baby, that Mamba mentality, always trying to be your best. And that's what I'm all about, striving to be your best. Anyways, to the point of the video, back in like September, a dude named Ryan hit me up saying that his mom was cancer free for 10 years and that he wanted like some custom cleats to symbolize this. Being October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, I was like, all right, let's do it. So I'm gonna show you today how I made the cleats let me know what you guys think. And if you want custom cleats, shoot me a DM on Instagram at McHugh and we can figure something out, man. I'm happy to do this. I love doing this. All right, peace. Uh, I just gotta take a moment right here to really soak up the sun. It's been like 17 degrees here in Ohio, and I'm taking any day I can that's over freezing, going to the pitch, and training. 